Uh, yes, uh, one of them walks out uh, with an average orcish persuasion. Uh, he's tall, very muscular, and has a uh, and carries a very large axe uh, uh, with him. <laughs> they are eyeing you very harshly, mm. like up and down. They're they're looking at you very uh, untrusting. I don't look yeah. them in the eyes. <laughs> What are they, baboons? They get fell, you fair so, so, uh, first, we thought they were bears and wanted to. Well, like, ba- based on my previous history check, I act however would be, whatever would be appropriate for this situation. Well, okay. if your last encounter was in like a guard sort of scenario, wouldn't it be putting an axe through their skull? Uh, <laughs> you know, that is a prejudgment, and I don't appreciate it. <laughs> <laughs> he could have been our humanitarian aid. Okay, you know, yeah, yeah. 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 he could have been providing food for them. <laughs> <laughs> it was actually part of, like, uh, the cookery corps. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Tyburn the cook. Uh, <laughs> Just, and this is now, like, our, our version of Steven Seagal. By the way, now I can't see Just Tyburn without uh, anything but, like, a... Uh, Without a collar that goes up to his like past his nose, <laughs> <laughs> it's just no. cold in here. It's just <laughs> Kenny from South Park now. <laughs> uh, but uh, the one that walks up to you does take uh, your horse by the reins, uh, and then a uh, a slightly taller one walks out in, uh, from behind the, a little bit of uh, foliage that he was stand he was kneeling behind and uh, and says. Take to camp for speak. Yes. All of us. All. No, all. One. One. Juan. Uh, we don't Juan. have a Juan. <laughs> I win. Juan. <laughs> Oh God! Now we're even more racist. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Um, Only okay. one. Uh, one. Uh. <laughs> I wouldn't have caught that, but I just watched Angry Joe's review of Mafia Three, and that—that oh, that was God. a joke. One. <laughs> <laughs> have you cool. met one yet? No, I haven't met one. Okay, minus one. <laughs> <laughs> that was a great review. Uh... <laughs> Uh oh wow. Well, um <laughs> I guess I'm um, the person to go. We're horrible people. You know that, right? You're the one to go, Tabard. I mean, you're the one that's offering the horse. I guess I'm already here and I okay, I guess I'm going to go. Bye, Tabard. I was like, I'm going to go talk to their chief. Can we follow them a, a safe distance? Uh, if you want to give it a shot. Uh, I look straight to Arlox, just like... You, do, you don't think we should? Tyburn die if we follow. Tyburn could die if we don't. Probabilities, man. Probabilities. <laughs> little well, bit of, I mean, they want to call me. A little bit of me. They, will, they want to kill me. I mean, they'll have the opportunity because my weapons and stuff are lying on the ground back there. <laughs> Well, I think it would probably be best for us to set up temporary camp here and wait for Tyburn to return. Okay, Kavara, make sure you pick up um, Tyburn's stuff as well, just in case. Like, mm-hmm. you need oh. to, like, run it over to him or something. The person that doesn't have any sort of mount or ability to carry things on a mount going oh, to I have shit. no carry room. I have carry carry. Room. To be fair, has the back of steel that, like, that, I, I that is the envy of all. 90 pounds of equipment. All right. Jesus Christ. Well, I'm, I'm going to ride up over here. You have a carry weight equivalent to like a, a, a smaller horse. <laughs> <laughs> I can only carry it. It pays off to be a six foot eight dragon. <laughs> but uh, I, I'm going to tie my horse up onto this tree and then I'm going to start like setting up. Yeah, get like firewood. <laughs> behind, well, behind this rock here, you know, I'm going to like. Well, like if up, we're going to take this uh, break, I, I will therefore use my new bard ability of Song of Rest so Snow's on full health. Uh, what was uh, your equipment, uh, yeah. Bob? Hmm? Which is uh, you drop? Uh, my crossbow and my uh, my mace. Okay, crossbow, so, mace, and gun. What, uh, roll one d six, lie and uh, snow, and you'll work out how many hit points you get. 
Wait, why slide? What? No, not slide. slide or... well, we, we technically all do, but we're all at full health. So. Well, my so, question, sir. real quick here, is... Um, no, fuck it. Why not? I just didn't want you to waste a spell slot when we could have... Uh, when I think we're already going to be doing oh, a short no, it, rest. It's not but... a spell. It's just an ability. Thing. All right. So, uh, Tyler, okay. you, you're going with them, correct? I Yes. Okay. I... No, no choice at this point now. Godspeed, Diamond. Oh God, <laughs> too far is can't pull out. <laughs> a single tear rolls down Borgfard's cheek as he watches Tyburn leave. So yeah, we'll make camp at just uh, just below the crest of the hill to the side of the road. I'm like, thinking right here behind this rock right here. So we have. We okay, okay. Yeah, doesn't matter. You, you, make make camp on this. you make camp on this map. We'll figure it out. Uh, but uh, so Tyburn, you're led by this group of what turns out to be only three orcs uh, for quite a while, actually. Uh, they don't seem to get as much <clears throat> tired at all. Uh, but the, And they're also not riding the horse. They, they're, just, they're just walking it. Uh, but uh, it's towards the late afternoon, pr almost twilight, like at night, you know, region of time, uh, when you come across uh, a very large clearing uh, and you see a encampment sitting uh, in this clearing, and there's also like a small uh, brook, uh, not like not even like a stream or something, just a small brook uh, winding around it. Uh, and uh, they have, by the way, they haven't spoken to you. Uh, hold on one second. I wouldn't okay. imagine they would have much to say to me. Helm good. <laughs> Helm protects. <laughs> Here's a pamphlet. Come every Sunday. I like to think that Tyburn's just got little pamphlets that he slips into people's bags. <laughs> that's not how this character works. That's how, that's how clerics work. You're, you're just passive aggressive about how you... Yeah, no, you're a follower, you're... not like a preacher. I, I preach through action. While we take this break, I'm going to continue building some Lego. I, I imagine Ooh. I just set up my like my my pot, and I got like a little like fire going, and then I'm making a little stew or something. <laughs> I tell Kavara to go get some rabbits or some shit. Nah. Oh, actually, no. I'm actually proficient in survival, aren't I? Are you? Yes, I am. Wait, let's list this be the second factor. You go get some food. Hopefully. God lets us. <laughs> I'm sat here playing some soothing music. He's getting some food. It's gonna be a good night. Sorry about that. That was uh, that was about the babysitting. Yeah, you know, Kavaro's getting food. Okay. The uh, the like I was saying, Tyburn's about to die. <laughs> as I was saying, uh, Tyburn, they they don't talk to you. Uh, they barely talk amongst themselves as you uh, uh, on your journey there. But uh, you come across this camp, uh, and they lead you through it. Um, it seems to be of moderate size. There are uh, something close to twenty largest tents. Kind of a raid all uh, uh, in like a around a central kind of area, uh, and they lead you to a very large tent uh, that's kind of sitting in the middle, uh, and uh, they gesture for you to go inside. I go inside. Okay, when you go inside, it seems to be mostly empty. There's uh, some small like uh, rugs laying around, uh, and a few like. Uh, pelts and such kind of arrayed all, uh, around the, the walls of the tent, but uh, nobody's in there with you. Uh, okay. <clears throat> and you're, uh, you're alone. Uh, back to the camp where everybody else is staying at. Uh, that uh, 15 survival, uh, I'm guessing that's for foraging. For finding or... some like rabbits or some shit. You find, uh, you find plenty of, uh, you find plenty of, uh, of edible uh, plants and uh, a few smaller animals. Uh, I'm trying to make a stew here. <laughs> yeah, and you uh, 
your time is pretty uneventful. The majority of it is just kind of sitting around getting things uh, kind of situated. Uh, More part situated. has liar's dice. Yeah, I, I do have liar's dice. I never got my... hours, how many hours has it passed since Tyron left? I got my uh, nickel bone dice. About two, maybe. Should we wait for another hour, or should we actually try to <laughs> get Tyburn? Well, I think we should just. I think we should wait for Tyburn to return. I feel like we we're on a knife's edge right now, Kavara. I I don't think we should do much from here. We should wait. If if morning comes and Tyburn's not back, then we'll go and I Port think we Fart should inquire. He's whispering to himself, not saying anything <clears throat> in particular. But if morning comes and Tyburn hasn't returned, I think we Tyburn should go uh, off in that direction. All. Well, I don't know. I think I think if we are caught trying to come onto this camp, then bad things are going to happen. Like for sure, I think Tyburn will be dead if we if we try to go there ourselves. Uh, so let's let's let the night pass and see what happens with Tyburn. And Steam got back to Tyburn. It's been half an hour, and you're still alone <laughs> in the tent. Uh, but then uh, the, the flap of the tent kind of opens up, and you see a uh, very large orc, uh, kind of in the same kind of garb uh, markings uh, that you saw the other ones in. Uh, this one, obviously, is much more important. Uh, and he looks you over uh, for a few seconds uh, and begins, What are you here for? Uh, he well. speaks in a very refined accent, by the way. <gasps> Gentleman dog. <laughs> he speaks in a British accent. They're sentient after all. Oh. Dude, you are racist. Who the fuck <laughs> is this? Hell are you? Fucking dragon. <laughs> well, I, I and my, my company have been sent here to uh, see about having you guys vacate. Well, because the... Uh, because the... <laughs> vacate. <laughs> I didn't say you know kill or anything. So that's good. Okay, so then... vacate because there's been a, as reported a number of attack by attacks by orcs on the road. Has this been requested of you from the local constabulary uh... from Dark Oak, the nearby town? Now, originally, they wanted me to get you back on the reservation. Now, I know not why you left, and that doesn't really matter that much to me, uh, why you left. My my concern is that uh, the the discord against the trading group... Well, is... my good man. <laughs> Speaking of discord, <laughs> I just dragged it over. What even? <laughs> good day, sir. <laughs> well, my good man. This tribe is not from a reservation. I am from a reservation. They are not. And I would not have them go to one. Okay. Recently, I have been living with them for quite a while. And we've been living in the hills, the uh, mountains to the north. <clears throat> Recently, we were drove from our home, this land which no one has settled or has been using. So, I don't really see why I have to consider your request. He told you to fuck off. <laughs> have you and your company been uh, attacking? Caravans coming through here and other traders, farmers taking their goods. We've been defending our lands. Defending your lands against helpless farmers. I have killed no farmers. In fact, one of my racial oh. compatriots lives near here. <laughs> Why you got to bring race into it, man? <laughs> Oh, God. And we have been quite amenable with him. In fact, he's been... He, even if we do not see eye to eye. Fuck. 
I know how I Joe would Joe gets a, 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 a small chill. <laughs> you're, you're not there. You're not there. His senses start tingling. <laughs> Your ears are burning. <laughs> Somebody knows. <laughs> Uh, How well equipped were these? Or was it like just kind of like just a camp? Is what this was when I walked in. Essentially. Okay, so we, I, I wouldn't make any mistake, Tolman, that we we were we were sent here to to you know root you out. You know, uh, there weren't any particular specific orders about you know how to get rid of you. I'd rather not, you know, slay everybody. I think that would be an escalation that's unnecessary. Um. But if not by us, it would certainly be by somebody else that would come in here and, you know, perhaps engage in conflict. Now, the impression I'm getting, and you can correct me if I'm wrong, is that you just kind of want to live in peace, right? Essentially. Okay. This isn't a good place to do it. No one farms this land. No one claims this land or lives on it. Well, that is beside the point. They don't want you here, and they are far better equipped, have far more men, and would get rid of you. Now, for your sakes, I would... Then why did they send only five to... Well, there's this thing called resource management... Which I'm not going to get into the specifics to uh, of necessarily because you seem to be doing a fine job here, but we we can start with us. You know, we were sent out here. Like I said, they were too discriminating about how we did this. I decided that it would be a good idea to uh, talk to you, see if there's uh, something amenable that could happen. Their position is that you leave, whether it's by us or them. Now I can guarantee you, having come from there, they can take care of you guys. I'd rather not see that happen. And where would you have us go? Well, that's something we can work on. Not my monkeys, not my circus. I scan for M-class planets. <laughs> you only find one. <laughs> Roll for reconsidering. <laughs> Draylon two. That's where you. That's where you. Well, what was it that drove you guys out of your home in the north to begin with? Oh. Some foul creatures took up residence in a local ruin. What kind of foul wow. creatures? I'm not too certain on the specifics. Did you fight them? <clears throat> not personally. How far away is this place? Quite deep in the spurs to the north. Maybe How many days travel? Two days, if you know where it's at. Well, I'll tell you what. Why don't you take me and my party up there? We can see what we can do about that. If we can get that situation figured out, how about you move back up there? And leave my tribe here alone? No, the, the tribe would go with you. So... Oh, you mean on this little journey? Qu quick clarification. Is he talking about I was, I was envisioning that it would be the, the, the party plus him and whoever he wants to bring with him go up there, check the stuff out. Um, I'm exactly. talking about he's move, asking, moving the tribe up there once that's dealt with. Yeah, he's, he's saying go with you and leave his tribe here while we're dealing with this up there. That's the context he's going for. Oh. Yeah, I don't think anything would befall your tribe. How do I know this isn't a trick? How do I know you're not sent here to draw me away? while these forces of which you speak come to clear us out. Well, I'm a cleric of Helm, and I, I obey uh, you know, his, his word and teachings. Do you have trust in that? I've learned not to trust humans. <laughs> you wouldn't be, sir. <laughs> what would, what would, bet, what would, uh, what would what would I have to do to gain your trust then? Is if my if my deity is not of any value to you, then what what can I give of value? Hmm. Your life. 
<laughs> just murders Tyburn right there. You're alive! Ah! I, try I shall speak human. with... I shall speak with... one of my more... acclimated acquaintances. Lives in the area. That is more familiar with the local government. Oh, please don't tell me it's the guy we murdered. <laughs> it's totally the guy it's we murdered. murdered. Or I murdered. I'll take responsibility. The guy I murdered, yeah. 100% is. He owns a farm not far from here. Oh. <laughs> is it towards Dark Oak? It's along one of the roads. What 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 is their name? Bodrick. Did we actually know the, the name of the guy? No. No, he didn't. No. Okay. Are they also an orc? Yeah, they were. Indeed. He we was able to upon, buy land. We uh, did happen upon a farm along our way here, but there was a grave marker there. Excuse me? There was a grave marker there upon the... Uh, as we came upon one of the farms on our way here. I know not if it is the same farm of which you uh, you speak of or not, but I didn't see very many other uh, lands of cultivation on our way here. He's uh, staring at you very untrustingly. <laughs> oh, God. I'll have to go speak with someone. Excuse me. We're fucked. We're fucked. <laughs> oh, and he, uh, oh. he leaves the tent. There's, there's no new timer. You should have just kept quiet. I wish I had psychic ability. I wish I had psychic ability. A ranger who can to, speak to... orcish. Well, I'm, I am so glad that I picked up heals in that level up. That's <laughs> not going to help if he's, gonna help <laughs> if he's got a... He has no head, you know? No, no, I well, mean... Well, he does I, have that... Lamp, that I mean, I picked up healing thing. spells Maybe we now. can grab his hands and put them on himself. That's not how that works. That's not how any of that works. Uh, uh, Mark thinks it is. <laughs> Tyburn, it, oh. it's, it's, it's about another half hour before this individual comes back in. Okay. I just got done speaking with Bodrick's spouse. She was here trading with us. Oh, he was married. Oh, oh fuck. We know this. We know this. Mm -hmm. We knew there was another occupant. We didn't know if it was his he wife. He was or not. fine when she left one day ago. And we have seen no one else come down the trade road other than you in the last two days. Think fast. Tybert, how's your deception? <laughs> Pretty good, actually, if I remember correctly. But would he lie, though? No, he wouldn't. No question. Or, or is he going to throw snow under the bus? <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say, sell out. Sell out. Say we've Snow's only got some very tender meat. Say we've only known one of our party for a while. It could have been him. <laughs> uh, I, I I'm not gonna <laughs> throwing your friend under the bus. No, I'm just, I'm, I'm just oh. saying. What did you do to your hair, Ben? <laughs> no, I, I went like this. Do whatever you feel would be best. That's a long way to say. I think I'll roll to try work out what you'd say. If you can't figure it out, always. Yeah. Dice I, I can see dice the are always the answer. Yeah. Moving in Bob's head right now. He's trying to figure this shit out. <laughs> He's piecing puzzles together and going, How do I not die? How do I not die? We're picking apart the alliance chain. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> oh, I'm literally what, I was hoping <laughs> Muscovy and France don't join in. Yeah, really. <laughs> that is literally what's going on. Gotta work out how much AE is going to go. Uh, so pop. If, I'm, if I'm the emperor and, and Borgfart is Prussia and Kavara is Poland and Snowfox is Württemberg. Well, none of my allies are going to answer the call because they're, it's a distant war for them. So. <laughs> or they're a debt. 
<laughs> or it'll destabilize their country, so they can't. Or both. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I, I'm not gonna encourage. Incur, I'm not. I, I don't want to encourage this, but I gotta say, uh, that <laughs> Snow's fuck up made this quest chain a lot more interesting. <laughs> <laughs> you don't. I feel say. like S- Snow's character just reformed, uh, just changed religion <laughs> to Helm, and he's in uh, religious turmoil right now, so he's no help. <laughs> I'm still here just building my Lego. Uh, <laughs> that's, that's, <laughs> Porkfar is wandering around in the, 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 the edge so, of the woods next to us, talking to himself. 